Hello viewers, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. Today we are going to discuss about cylinder liners. So what is a cylinder liner? Cylinder liner is a hollow element which is present in between the piston and cylinder. It is an important element which encloses the piston to perform the combustion reaction or the four strokes or a two strokes of cycle. So this is the piston and outer is present is the cylinder in between is cylinder liner so it is a hollow cylindrical shell which acts as an enclosure in which the combustion take place a cylinder liner is a removable component cylindrical in shape inserted into the engine block it provides the surface for the piston to slide and carry out its compression task it can be replaced when worn out. Cylinder liners are made from close grained cast iron because it suffers from wear and tear. So we want to use the materials for the cylinder liners that should withstand the wear and tear and resistance to heat somewhat. Then conditions to meet are strength, wear resistance and corrosion resistance. The material used are grey cast steel. It is a cast steel which is grey in color which withstand the thermal cycling. Thermal cycling is the repeated heating and cooling of the cooling property and uh, vanadium and titanium. Chromium plate liners to reduce wear close grained cast iron or fine lamellar cast iron in recent designs so two types of liners are present one is wet liners and dry liners in wet liners the water is in direct contact with the outer surface of the liner in dry liners the water is in indirect contact with outer surface of the liner that is a cylinder casting contains water jackets so what is the, the different differences are provided either in the original design or even afterwards should be included in the original design cylindrical design and there is no requirement for a leak proof joint between cylinder casting and liner because the dry liners are kept in water jacket in wet liners a leak proof joint must be present between the cylinder casting and liner in dry liners a cylinder block with dry liners is most robust than with wet liners in wet liners it is less robust in dry liners it cannot be finished before fitting to cylinder block in wet liners it can be finished before fitting then production of liners usually the liners are produced by sand casting as well as centrifugal casting but the condition is if you want to produce small liners we prefer centrifugal casting and if you want to produce large liners for huge machines such as turbines etc it must be produced you by the method of sand casting only the inner surface of the cylinder liner is usually chrome plated to make it smooth and to withstand the wear resistance but the smoothness does not allow oil to spread out properly so we have to make pores so that the oil can spread evenly inside the surface of the cylinder production of the liners in order to provide a harder wearing surface the bore of the liners is subjected to the process of nitriding so nitriding is a heat treating process in which the nitrogen is diffused into the surface of the metal to provide a case hardened surface it is usually performed on the low carbon and medium carbon steels Sometimes it is used in the 
titanium molybdenum etc so this is a short video friends if you like this video please click the thumbs up button and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and so please like share and subscribe this channel for more videos and thank you for watching